Hello and welcome guys to my showcase of the Spartan Assault Tank from the Age of Darkness box set for well, the new Horus Heresy of course. So here it is in the black and reds of the Dark Angels, the first legion. So yeah, finished this guy in about two days, but it should have been three day two, was quite a crunch. So yeah, just spray it black, uh, then I sponge everything, like all the edges, with um, Incubite Darkness, and then another sponge with Thunderhawk Blue for all the edges, and then I went back in for all the corner of the edges with the Incubite Darkness and then Thunderhawk Blues again. So yeah, the colors will be in the description below. The red, so just Mephiston, red shaded with Carbo Crimson, edge highlighted with Mephiston again, and then Evil Sun Scarlet. The track is pretty easy to do. It was just I sprayed it with the a gunmetal uh, color, dry brush it with Iron Warriors, and then Lead Belcher, and then give everything a nice coating up no oil so it looks it doled down the shine a bit and yeah still look a bit rough and dirty it, it is in my style of cleaner um style you would say clean just not too much edge highlighting less than i would usually do so yeah the doors on the sides and the front hatch are 3d printed the link to them will be in the description below or at least their name the bottom open i try dry brush the inside with iron warrior and lead welch here again the silvers are everything else for the gun mainly i just again spread it gun metal dry brush with the iron warrior uh, and then give it a coat of no oil and that's it do down look i don't want to do too much um a bit of casing uh with red the i don't think you can really see the scope inside or should i say the little targeting thing but it is in green the cables are just caliban green shaded with uh, acrox earthshade and then caliban green warpstone glow and then a little tiny bit of uh, what you call mood green and yeah that's pretty much it for the painting it's pretty easy without any weathering like not too much ash highlighting you should able be, to be cranked out pretty fast so here's the top it's the bronze just about the gold and then across earth shade a little bit of details for the light, uh, lights and a bit of the sensors green a bit of blue green and yellow there so it's pretty hard to see it pretty dark maybe i should crank up the front light oh let's see if we can have a little better no it doesn't really show but aside from that yeah not too much modification for this kid just filling in the gaps uh with a little bit of putty i use watch about this the perfect plastic putty from deluxe material you can clean it with water so don't need any sanding just use a bit of water thin it down fill it in and then you with a q-tip a bit of water and just clean it off a bit of intersection here i did varnish everything in satin and also here is a picture of the spawn with my Sikern omega tank destroyer and back to the video for all the gaps the side sponson are removable. It is a bit loose even after painting. It, they will still hold their position, but I will just put a little bit of silicone glue. I don't know what it's called. It's glue, but it's a bit soft like rubber. And it you can mess around a bit. So yeah, just thicken that up. So it would actually be a bit more sticky, as you would say not sticky it's a bit stronger on the friction and the front are removable i did uh, magnetize them one in each gun and then two in each in each of the slot to a total of four in the whole mount itself so here are the heavy bolters 
I let the heavy flamer out because I will probably never use them. So yeah, they just fit right in. I know those are 2 by one millimeter magnets, if you're wondering. So yeah, pretty easy, not too much to go around for this kit, it's just a tank after all. But a bit of size comparison, here is one of the Mark VI Marine. And yeah, it is the Sergeant. <laughs> Doesn't really fit even with the top hatch open, and silly to say that this Spartan actually fits 25 model but we all know GW did scale down their vehicle quite a little bit so, and here is a cataphracty terminator yeah so as you can see yeah the what you call them terminator fit a little they won't go through the doors but yeah and then again, the newer Mark 6 is a bit bigger, so yeah. That's, oops, that's that. So yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. More Horrors Heresy painting showcase will come soon enough as I finish painting them. So yeah, watch out for those. Until next time, remember, like, comment, subscribe, your thought down below. And yeah, till next time, stay safe, stay awesome. Have a nice day and goodbye.